Hi, welcome to Math Test Prep, where today we're going to answer a standardized math test question using the Pythagorean Theorem. A rectangle and one of its diagonals are shown in this diagram. Based on the dimensions in the diagram, what is the value of x? So we are told that this is a rectangle. When you are given a rectangle, we know that they have four right angles. So we know that this is a 90 degree angle, and that forms a right triangle. We know two of the three sides of the right triangle, so we can use Pythagorean theorem for right triangles to find the missing side. We know that A and B in a right triangle, when we're using Pythagorean theorem, are the legs that form the right angle. So 15 and 20 are the legs, A and B, and C is the hypotenuse, which is the side directly across from the right angle. Opposite the right angle is our hypotenuse, C. So now let's place all the values we know. We're going to say A is 15 and B is 20. These are interchangeable because they are the two legs that form it. The order of this doesn't matter. And then it equals the hypotenuse squared, which is X squared. So now the first step is to do 15 squared, which is 225, and 20 squared, which is 400. Now we're going to add 225 and 400, which is 625. Now to find the value of x, the inverse of x squared is finding the square root. If whatever we do to one side, we must do to the other. So we're going to find the square root of 625, and that will equal x. And 25 times 25 is 625, so therefore our missing diagonal length is 25 feet.